Hey there, I'm going to show you something that's pretty basic, but if you don't know about it, it could really speed up some of your work. Um, so I've got this sequence called Awesome. <laughs> I said Awesome. Awesome Cats sequence, and I got a folder full of awesome cat photos, and I'm going to uh, select all those photos and drag them over my timeline and put them in my timeline. So what we got here is we got a bunch of cat photos, but they're all too big. They're at 100% and they're bigger than my um, sequence settings. So uh, I want to change all these using effects controls to, uh, to make them smaller. So I need to click on the clip and then change the scale down. And then, if I use my down arrow key, I go to the next clip. But I have to click on that clip, and then I can change the scale down. Well, what if I don't want to have to click on each clip in my timeline to then scale it down? Well, here's what you want to do. You go to Sequence down to selection follows playhead and now every time I hit my down arrow and go to the next clip it's selected and I can just scale down my uh, photo from there S scale hit my down arrow key and scale hit my down arrow key and scale I skipped one, so I'll hit my up arrow key. Don't want to miss this guy and scale. So now I'm just using my keyboard and my mouse, and I'm just going through all these photos and I'm scaling them, and uh, and then also I can position them, and I don't have to click in my timeline at all every time I want to change a new clip. Hope that was helpful. Thanks.